there's something distinctly unchristmassy about it, and yet it feels like a Christmas film. In that it's kind of feel good in this old timey, kind of strange 1950s way, and it is set on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day entirely. And yet it just it's not it's not really Christmas Eve, but it is. It's very confusing. You have these three guys, Humphrey Bogart leads them, and he's fantastic as always. They break out of prison, okay, on Christmas Eve. They go in to this town and they basically just kind of take up residence in, in, in this shop and they get involved with this family and it's just so good. It doesn't sound like much of anything. It's just so good. These three guys are so funny without, it's not like a big slapstick comedy style. It's not even very, how would you say, extroverted comedy? It's very subtle, but so wonderful. It's a very hard film to describe. You just gotta watch it, okay? You just gotta find it somewhere this Christmas and watch it. It's kind of like the very first one of those Christmas films where somebody goes into like a remote location and changes their whole personality. In a way, it's a little bit like one of those, okay? These three guys, they come in, of get better and behave better as it goes on. M mostly the whole thing is driven by their want to steal stuff from these people. Yeah, I'm giving this 89 out of 100, but God knows, you know, I give it another watch this year, maybe it sneaks that 90, I don't know. And watch out for the snake. The snake is good. Oh yeah.